Hi, I'm Linda Newton, and this is Answers from Mom and Dad. Well, at least, Mom, Dad's still recuperating. Happy New Year! Oh, yes, I know. It's been a couple of weeks, and many of us are so over it. But it's still a new year, and we still have opportunity to rewrite our destiny. I want to share with you some tools. Tools from Dr. Jeffrey Schwartz, who's done remarkable work helping people who have obsessive compulsive disorder. Those are those folks with those intrusive compulsive thoughts that I have to wash my hands a hundred times or I have to check the back door to make sure it's locked two dozen times before I can sleep. Now that can be very debilitating, but if Dr. Schwartz can make a difference in those folks with the way they think, we can surely learn from him. He has four R's that are going to help us all. The first is we're going to relabel those stinking thinking thoughts. And then we're going to see them as signals, symptoms of our dysfunctional thinking. Instead of saying, it's the truth, when I tell myself, I can't, I'll never get a date with a decent guy, uh, that woman will never go out with me, I'll never get a promotion, I'm never going to get ahead in life, I can't do that because fill in the blank. All of that stinking thinking comes from within us, and it's dysfunctional. So instead of telling myself it's the truth, I'm going to tell myself it's from my dysfunction and relabel it as that. The next, my stinking thinking is going to be reattributed to part of my stinking neural pathways. So I need some new neural pathways that tell me I can instead of all this stinking thinking that tells me that I can. I've relabeled it as part of my dysfunction. Then I reattribute it to faulty neural pathways. I'm going to refocus my stinking thinking and I'm going to begin to focus on what's constructive and what's helpful. If you remember from our last video, the rubber band exercise where we snap that rubber band to do some thought stopping and then we refocus on something more positive, great way to, to create new neural pathways. I relabel, I reattribute, I refocus, and then I revalue. Very important. I see these negative thoughts as of no value to me any longer. We hold on to them and we can wrap up in them like a nasty old bathrobe that we're comfortable in. And then we just hunker down in our misery and stay there. Or I can relabel, I can reattribute, refocus, and revalue and decide this has no value for me anymore. I am going to start thinking positively. I'm going to replace my thoughts and focus on what I can do and not what I can't. Because we all know we're the sum total of what we believe ourselves to be. I want you to try these awesome tools by Jeffrey Swartz. If it works for folks with OCD, it can certainly work for us. Give it a go and give us some feedback. Tell us what you think. Thanks so much for your thoughts and your prayers and your shares for Dad. He's getting better and he'll be joining us soon. You have a good one.